All right, guys. Um, you don't know what this is? This is Vote Plays Final Fantasy. It's where we, as a forum, on um, on Vote, play through Final Fantasy. The forum, of course, is the Final Fantasy forum. But it's just something to do to kind of reintroduce yourself to the series, or if it's your first time, introduce yourself to the series. So it's definitely very fun, and I definitely suggest check it out. I'm actually going to link the forum down below. So if you guys are interested, check it out. And it's just a community around Final Fantasy. I mean, there's not really, there's not much to say after that. Like, it's a Final Fantasy community. Uh, right now, we're actually in um, the Southern Cave from um, from uh, Melmond. That's the place. So yeah, we're just fighting through the cave. Uh, we're in a situation right now where I'm pretty sure we're just gonna have to like fight every single Gigas in the world. Hence the name of the last video I had. Where every single Gigas hates us. I don't know why, but they just do. Perfect. It's very good because now Warwick should be able to end this fight. Yep, there it is, it's over. And Sticky gained a level, which is very good. I mean, we've been gaining an insane amount of levels because we got trapped in this situation where we're just <laughs> we're just fighting Gigas's over and over and over, which I'm fine with because we get a lot of experience from it. But I kind of want to explore some more, you know. We definitely need to cure Iqbal right now. Iqbal is in a situation where she might die. That would be no boy enough for us. Wow, two hits. That's the first time Sticky's actually gotten two hits. That's impressive. And Warwick, of course. Warwick has become my MVP. He just ends these fights like that. He's like, oh, you wanted to fight? Well, too bad. Now you're murdered. <laughs> We're running pretty low on potions. I should have probably bought more. I didn't think I'd need more, but... And these Gigases. I mean, they're not killing my people, but... They're making it tough to survive. I feel like this should probably be the last fight we have with them. I mean, I can't imagine it lasts anymore. But d definitely, the rule of thumb is don't go on the left side, apparently, because Gigases will try to murder you. Or go on the left side because they're trying to murder you and just steal all the experience and kill you can. Perfect. If they all attack off, my life would be perfect because I'd still have all my potions because he's insanely good at defense. I don't know, am I kind of like a glitch where it's just going to permanently attack me every single time? This is no bueno. use Cure 3 on Sticky. This could end really badly. If Sticky dies here, then I've just wasted Cure 3, which is very valuable because of, of course, life. I can't use life if I use Cure 3. I don't think I can use life. No. Perfect. Looks like he missed him, and that should probably end the fight, actually. I mean, once Wari, uh, Warwick and Loth attack, they're gonna end it. I'm actually really happy with how it's gone, though. I mean, this is kind of insane. We've gotten a ton of experience from this. And a, even more importantly, a ton of gill, which means we can improve our um, fighters like Sticky and Iqbal mostly. Man, more. You know what? I'm gonna try to flee, I think. Yeah, I'm done with this Gigases. I want some potions to, like, be there for when I actually have to fight something. 
because as it is right now, we're probably going to have to escape out of here. Um, just uh, because we're not prepared to fight the vampire if we don't have any potions. I know it's kind of lame, but I do want to be able to actually, you know, heal my people as we're progressing through the cave. That's a very good place to train, though. I feel like we'd get a lot of experience there. As you saw, we got an insane amount of experience. So, the west is kind of examined there. And now we can actually go right back up to Melmond and kind of, you know, just get more um, potions. I don't know why I keep on going north on the right side because I know it doesn't lead anywhere. I'm just like, let's go. Let's do it, guys. And now I've got Sticky doing double hits. It's very good. Means he's going to be a much more potential damage dealer than he was before. And, I mean, that's all we really need is some heavy hitters. And NPU does run out, so the idea of him being able to do physical attacks more efficiently is very good. I'm actually really excited. I'm still really excited for this because I played through the beginning of Final Fantasy and if it sounded, I don't know, I don't know if it sounded like I was getting bored on some of those videos, but like, I don't, it's just, I had, to, I had already done what I was doing and now I'm just like, this is new. I've got to figure out what's going on. Grant, I didn't, I didn't remember everything, so there were some spark, uh, parts I got stuck on, but still, definitely very fun. we're gonna kill that shadow and the more we kill the less we got to deal with all these like misses they've got on us and that should be it for this guy he's not gonna be able to survive should be just right from here so it looks like they got an ambush on us I'm not too worried about Stiggy's health so I'm just gonna try to fight through it all going to be uh, more kind of worrisome if I get in a situation where the people I'm fighting are just like 20 of them. Like against ogres because I've got two heavy damage dealers. They can normally take one out each. Sometimes. But just something to keep in mind I guess. Perfect. Because now what is the ogre, ogre chieftain is not going to kill Sticky. He could hit him for some serious damage. But I don't think he's going to kill him. And there it is guys, another victory. <laughs> that was not good. Oh, that's very not good. If he goes below 30, I'll heal him. They're all missing him. I mean, that's good for me, but I'm just surprised. Came with the fury right there. Perfect. That should heal him for a little bit. I was hoping for a little bit more, but it happened. I 
I just don't want to use a bunch of potions on him. That's like the point I'm at right now. Why am I using potions on Sticky would be wasteful because we're so close to the end. And if he dies, I mean, it's not that bad, but it's just kind of annoying. Perfect. I'm just going to the inn and heal for a little bit. Looks like they're all level 13, which is good. I mean, we're increasing in levels, we're getting more powerful, and I think it mostly means the vampire is screwed. Like, he's not going to be able to kill us. I do want to improve Sticky's abilities here because he needs to be able to kill more things. I'm really curious about. I am really curious about poison. I feel like it's a really wasteful ability because I don't think it'll do what it says. I feel like what it would do is deal damage over time, but if it instantly defeats enemies. Why not try it? Wasn't there an item shop around here somewhere? I thought so. I might be wrong. There might just be like no item shops, no nothing. Well, to solve that situation, I'll just go around in circles. That seems like a good plan. So there's the armor shop. Is there no item shop? If there is no item shop, I'm going to be very disappointed. It is going to mean a long trek east. Uh, no item shop. That's very disappointing. It's going to mean we have to go east, guys. Good thing is we get to kind of get kill more enemies, which means more experience, but it's just kind of annoying to have to backtrack so much. Nice. Sticky had it. It's actually gonna be where is it right here? It's somewhere here. Now we can go south. I was like going south and I was like, I realized I was like, wait, this isn't a good idea. Private's here, he is done. Yeah, freaking Warwick, he's not letting him on the ship. Yeah, quite a bit of a gill. I mean, compared to what we have been getting, not that much, but compared to what the, um, like, experience gain is, it. It just makes sense. Nice. And this also means we can now- Oh, you jerk. What a jerk, right? He just completely jumped in our way. No regard for our feelings whatsoever. I would like to buy every potion in the world. And also a fair amount of antidotes. Because I do believe poison exists somewhere. I figured I might as well do it because I don't need gill yet. I mean, I do need gill, but I can always get it back. You saw those gigas? There's, there's got to be more enemies like that, right? Perfect. Now we should be able to go west more. We just gotta ride the um, wall until we get back in. It's actually not that bad of a trek. 
I mean, we're already here, pretty much. There's the cave we need to be in. I think. Actually, no. That's a different cave, I guess. That was the dwarf cave. But anyways, I'm actually going to end the video there. Uh, that was a good trek. Uh, we learned a lot about Giguses and how much they're jerks. But now we're a super, super experienced um, party, which means we're going to be able to kill everything. As always, though, thank you for watching. Definitely check out the forum. And just uh, have a great day, guys.